Hello, good morning viewers. This is the question I submitted on my Facebook page yesterday, asking people to suggest the best approach for solving this problem. And most of the submissions was to clear the fractions by multiplying each term by the LCM of these three denominators. And I equally buy the idea. So let me do that. To clear the fractions, you need to know the LCM. The LCM between these three numbers is 12. So we are going to multiply each of these terms by 12. So this is what you are going to do. To multiply all of these numbers by 12. So this simplifies to 12. Multiply by 3x minus 2. Divide by 4 as our denominator. Minus 12 again. Multiply by 2x plus 3. Divide by 3. This is equal to 12. Multiply by 2. Divide by 3. Minus 12 multiplied by x, which is the same thing as 12x. To clear the fractions, we know that um, 4 can go into 4 one time and 4 can go into 12 three times. So I will do it step by step. This becomes 3 multiplied by 3x minus 2. Then we have minus here. 3 can go into 3 one time and 3 can go into 12 four times. So we have 4. In bracket we have 2x plus 3. Equality sign. 3 can go into 3 one time and 3 can go into 12 four times. We have 4 multiplied by 2 minus 12x. Gradually, we use these numbers outside the bracket to expand. 3 multiplied by 3x is 9x. 3 multiplied by negative 2 is negative 6. Negative 4 multiplied by 2x is negative 8x. Negative 4 multiplied by 3 is negative 12. This is equal to 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 minus 12x. We have 9x here. We have negative 8x. We have negative 8x. We have negative 12x to the right. If it crosses over, it becomes positive. 12x. And to the right, we still have it there. Taking negative 6 over it becomes positive taking negative 12 it becomes um, positive as well let us simplify and get our answer 9 minus 8 is 1 and 1 plus 12 is 13 so we have 13 x here and to the right we have uh, 8 plus 6 is 14 then 14 plus 12 is 26 so we have 26 here what we are looking for is x therefore we can divide both sides by 13 and finally x is equal to 26 divided by 13 which is just equal to 2 x equals 2 is the final answer to this problem Thank you for watching. Do share to your learning colleagues and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more exciting videos. Bye bye.